Alright, let's talk to uh, Coach. Hey, hey. Sure, what's up? How you doing, Coach? I'm good. good. Listen, you gotta hold on to the ball more, MP. I'm already doing a lot out there, Coach. Well, I, it's not that I don't want you to take risks, but I need you to tighten up a little bit. I mean, we're past the point of playing loose. We're playing sloppy. All right, yeah, I hear you. Look, I just need you to tighten up, okay? I just play cautiously for the next couple games, and then we'll see where that gets us. All right, Coach, I got it. Hey, what you working on? Coach wants us to not turn the ball over. It'll be the Celtics off the tip. And Grant, how often do I players do that. check in on their own stats during a season? BA. Everybody in the league watches their numbers. Some of them are just willing to admit it. Oh. That was, that was a. Horford against Ingram. Man, I wanted that. I should have just shot it. And he can't get that one. And Boston going the other way now. Well, they put up a nice win against Chicago last time out. And in that one, the bench came to play. They gave the team a bunch that of one. points. Oh. And oh. Brandon Whitney, the assistant coaching staff, what they were stoked about is that the bench guys came in and played well. So punch off the bench. A big factor in that win. And Williams drops them both. And we plan on it. And I need a mic. A steady force on their offense, recording around 14 and a half a game, and finished off by Graham. Wow. Okay. I'll tell you, such an advantage having a playmaker who can get up to the rim and finish. Now that is what every team wants. I'd like to see that assertiveness, especially from the guy who's going to orchestrate your offense. Here's Williams, following the score by New Orleans. Off the mark with the outside fadeaway. Oh, he's a guy that can uh, produce from the mid range. He doesn't miss too many open looks from there. Oh, yo, what? It down. I'll grab it that. Looks like Zion's got the stage all to himself so there, big. just tearing down. 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 Williams on the wing. Graham covering. Austin Why? 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 Okay. Two of three to get this one going. Yeah. Just over a minute and a half in. And I really oh, hey. great job on the back end of the play. Yep, finished with both hands, making sure of it. Williams against Graham. Outside Richardson. Outside Williams. Six on the shot clock. Fades and shoots. Offensive rebound. Right, I'm tripping. Oh, got a piece of it. And stolen by Graham. Pass to Hayes. To the paint. Brown with the steal. Now the Celtics on the move. Here's Tatum. What the? Will not go. <laughs> this is off the front iron. Yo, For New Orleans, what? they've gone three of four to get things going. There aren't many players that have come into the NBA as a consensus number one pick like Zion Williamson did. Nobody was past Crazy. The Celtics have gone 0 for 5 to begin this game. Now 
outside. Williams. Tatum with a screen to end the drought. Williams Yo. misses. In that 2019 oh. draft, Zion was surprised that every team in the lineup was hoping to win, Brad. And that added a lot of excitement to that night. I mean, when you've got a once in a generation talent like Zion, the lottery becomes a major event. <laughs> Two point. It's the same. All right. Come on, man. Oh, MP throws it down. Getting up and then throwing it down. Oh, that was a big hammer right there. Pass to Williamson. Back to Grant. And finished off by Grant. Why am I so slow? Zion plays within the system. I'm jumping right up. Very unselfish. It's Williams. High post. 20 points for him last game against Chicago. Oh, my goodness. Him offensively. It seems to be rushing shots. Shantai Alexander Walker, no good. And here we go. The Celtics on the run. Now, here's Williams. Hovering around 19 and a half points a game. His scoring has been huge for them. This feels like what is going on? on where he tries to shoot his way out of this slump, the worse it seems to get. They need him to get it together. Now here's Graham. I am trying to... Oh, man. Williamson is double. Ingram against Williams. And Ingram gets it to go. Dude. On the oh, assist for Graham. This, <laughs> this run this is here, by their man of poor defense. Passes to Horford. It's tipped. And he recovers it. The shot's good. Now they've attacked the boards here in the first quarter. New Orleans in the lead. Outside Graham. Here's the drive. His fourth make and five drives. Solid start for him. Defensively, they've got to get more bodies in the paint. That's three straight field goals from below the free throw line. Williams against Graham, who poked away. Brown passes to Williams. Over Graham. Williams Dude. misses. Ha. It's been an ugly play. <sighs> Trying to shoot his way out of it. Might be time to work on the playmaking skills. Brown against Ingram. Williamson outside. Outside Ingram. Six to shoot. Pass to Alexander Walker. Back to Graham. <sighs> Oh, and there's the this a little move. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Down by, I mean, up by one. Oh, nice spot. Oh, man. The Celtics with the lead. So for New Orleans right now. It's an all Duke forward pair. Ingram the three, Zion the four. It's Graham and Alexander Walker at the one and the two. Come on, Graham. It's Hayes and at the center position, locking down the middle. Let's check in with our reporter, mm -hmm. Allie LaForce. VA, the Boston Celtics last year had the team's worst win percentage in the last six seasons. The front office admitted, as constituted, they were not a championship caliber team. Now, for this proud franchise, mm -hmm. accustomed to competing deep into the playoffs, the question becomes, how do they get back on top? Yeah, that's a big one. Good stuff there, Allie. Thanks. Now here's Williamson. Scoring around 28 and a half points a game. A very talented offensive player. Five on the clock. Ingram finds Graham. Here's Williamson. Oh, he misses the go-ahead basket. The Celtics shooting 40% so far in this one. Here's Brown. Jay Allen. What the? What? Ingram's got a rebound number five here tonight. Stop and pop. Ram for three. And that one falls. His fifth basket. Now we got this dude in these. Ingram and his court Ooh, awareness gosh. continue to grow. A terrific dime there. Williams from long range. Oh, damn. Last touch by Williams. Damn. Here's Graham. He's got 13. Outside Ingram. Shouldn't he? 13 points. 
And just about a minute and a half has passed here in the second quarter. Block. He can't get it to go. Nice D from Brown. Austin Trailer. There's the three. Alexander Walker grabs the board. Oh, Pelicans have been one of four oh, shots to what? go in. Tip. And now the Celtics on the move. Williams on the wing. Graham covering. Again, MP missing. How? I, mean, I don't know. Does he look a couple steps slower today? He needs to he shake that is. off and get oh, yes, sir. So that's my defense. Right get out of here. Again, just watching Zion's leaping ability. Gets over the defense and easily finds some rim. Tipped. Outside, Williams. Second chance shot. Thank you, and one. That's on Devontae Graham. And for players these days, a lack of shooting can be a big hindrance. Graham, would you be more concerned by struggles from the perimeter or the free throw line? I'd be more concerned with struggles at the free throw line. I mean, if you struggle there, you can be... Let me see how many points he got. They become very, very tentative out there on the court. And opponents can foul to force your hand. No. That's cool. And both free throws good for Graham. The Celtics have gone 0 for 6 in the second. Not looking good. Williams against Graham. Tries to break his ice. Oh, it's blocked by Williamson. Zion just aggressive there and great timing. Down low. Oh, How is that my? Oh, nice one jam here. Hey, point. Tatum passes to Williams. Over Graham. Boston, no good that time either. Yo, Their strong what? work ethic has been evident on the glass. Really getting after it and being physical. Shoots off the step back. And a missed layup. Boston has gone 0 for 3 from Go deep ahead, to begin the second. I, I don't want to. Richardson. Go ahead. Williamson against Williams to the inside. Put it up! Shot clock at six. Inside. Tatum. Here's Horford. You got a piece you. of it. And here's Ingram from the arc. Good. Brent. Graham with the setup. And it's a nine point Pelican lead. And a breakdown here, guys. The hustle stats for the Pelicans. Well, in their first time. play. They're closing out aggressively. The block shots, a key indicator of their activity defensively. I also love the early energy that they've played with, pushing the ball every chance they get, exploring quick shots, and showing some serious fast break offense. Williamson with a screen on Richardson. Here's Alexander Walker, guarded by Richardson. Tries it from the block. No good off the back of the rim. Boston's gone just one of four from downtown so far in the second. Williams against Graham. Fades away. Rebound Why? Ingram. Why? Ingram's got Why? six rebounds now in the game. You think about the early part of Brandon Ingram's career. So long and so skinny, people worried about his frame. And that he might not have hey. the ability to put on the weight and deal with the rigors. That's not true. Right side, Williams. Over Graham. Boston, no good Yo, that time either. What is New Orleans wrong? has got three of their seven threes to find the net in this matchup. And when it comes to Ingram's strength, Brent, he's proved it doesn't affect his ability to be a dominant scorer. Well, Kevin Durant, Steph Curry, you know, of recent no. memory, guys that what? came in. Why? People thought they were going to get pushed around. Ingram now doing the pushing, especially on the offensive end. Now the Celtics on the move. Richardson for three. Oh, please. And the rebound goes of to the Pelicans. Course not. They've led by as much as ten. There's one principal reason why they're sitting on this lead. Rebounding. Williamson finds Ingram. And Jalen Brown. You see.
Offensively, it's been a struggle for him. Yeah, they need to string together some shots to have any kind of chance. Outside, Williams. Outside, Tatum. From the arc. Sinks out. Let's go. Thank you. Thank you. Three. Nice play. Tatum consistent with that jump shot, especially off the catch. Here's Williamson. And good. Coming on the assist by Sadoransky. Assisted. Sadoransky's got four assists in the game. Right side, Williams shoots over Saturday. So, Williams misses. Damn it, man. He just hasn't been able to get it going this period. No, I haven't seen him in, in comfortable spots or at least spots we've seen in this offensive set that are allowing him to settle in. Here's Brown. Shot Go. blocked. Boston. That's that lady is foul, man. That shit late as hell. Late as Bob. Took a head on approach in the first half. Right. Went straight at the D and drawing fouls. They almost mm, inviting be contact and attack mentality on full display. Richardson and Brown, the two and the three. Jason Tatum Crazy. out there with Al Horford. And it's Williams in at the point guard position. That's who's in the game for the Celtics. From the right block, the bank no good. Me that That's a shot man. they want just about on every possession. Oh. If they can get it, he doesn't make them all, but still very much can a I... percentage look. Thanks. Well, MP in their last game against the Bulls made a big difference. He scored 20 points. And Come on. How aggressive he was. Check out how many times he got to the free Yo, throw. Yo, that was a nice three, steal, a nice pass. I get back in the winning column. Thanks, guys. Hey, he made play after play, no. really solid effort all night. And he did it in a variety of ways, which makes him harder for opponents to deal with. Well, he can do a lot of different things, so he falls into these different roles. Yeah. Which will it be tonight? Brandon recognizing the size mismatch and then turns it into an easy basket there. They've got to do a better job with defensive help. Here's Williams. No luck on that no. one. And New Orleans will go the other way with it. Next up, the Knicks in New York. That game will conclude the three-game road trip they're currently on. Outside Graham. Williamson against Horford. Graham for three. And that basket makes him six for 11. Shooting a good percentage. Doing a lot of nice work now from the field. He's helped get them this lead, and now he's helped them keep it. Here's Williams, and Williams oh, punches it home. Just great offense. The screen freeing him up for the slam. Hey, without, hey, without that, that screen, screen, he doesn't get a clean look at the rim. Yeah, well, he settled settle for the layup when you can attack the rim. And rise up Why? Why? Why the hell? Kind of oh. Yeah, especially when it's coming from your point guard. Flush. Yeah, great read, nope. calls his own number, and then sends it home. Williams in the post. Graham covering. And he got the whistle. Jackson Hayes. That's his first personal foul. First team foul. But still continues to contribute. And for Horford, he still puts up decent totals. Brent, the efficiency is what is faltering. Well, up there, he's going to start making plays and try to be a conduit for the offense. The aid. Coaches trust that decision making and that experience. Oh, thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you for that. Game. Boston on D. Nine point game. Pass to Alexander Walker. Shot clock at five. And another shot. The shot back. No good. 
the Celtics have got only one of four shots to fall in the second half. Tatum, a screen on Graham. Williams into the lane. The kick out to Richardson. Brown passes to Williams. Pass to Horford. Again, the block. A beast is a stalwart so far. That's six blocks. Protecting the rim well. Love the hustle. Ingram, the pass to Williamson. Three pointer. And it's Ingram with the basket. On the assist by Williamson. Ingram's got 12 points in the game. Getting more and more consistent, which means more dangerous as Brandon Ingram knocks down three. The three pointer has not been his weapon in this one. He had one in the first quarter, it's still zero. I don't know if you push the panic button now, but that's the fourth personal. He needs to stay aggressive out there, so it's going to be interesting to see how he plays moving forward. From seven feet, Graham misses. Boston has gone over two from outside here in the third. And stolen by Williamson. And that's five. One more and Yeah, whatever. Oh, somehow we managed to magically down back one. Celtics has been outstanding. Closing out on shots and blocking quite a few as well. I love the advantage they've also racked up in the steals department. They've been very persistent on defense. Ingram against Williams. Hernan Gomez sets a screen. 11 feet out. Zadaransky outside. Just three to shoot. Some solid defense from Williams. Teammates right now covering up for the type of off performance he's having. In terms of scoring, this did not be the best day. Yo, what the? To the inside. The kick out to Williams. Back to Canner. The Celtics got to hurry here. Smart for three. And the rebound goes to the Pelicans. Hernan Gomez has got seven rebounds in the game. Here's Marshall. Back to Sadoransky. Shoots from the block. Williams grabs the board. Williams has got six rebounds in the game. Nine seconds separating the shot clock and game. Yo! What? Canner, the pass to Williams. The kick out to Williams. It's stolen by Hart. Yo, what? Count it. And his energy like that on both ends of the floor. That's got them out ahead. Outside, Williams. Over Sabransky. And no good. The end of the third quarter. Let's just go. Oh, no. Sports. So for New Orleans right now, Ingram at the three, Zion at the four. Josh Hart is out there with a hook take. Good whistle there. It's his second personal foul. And he knocks down the first one. And Williams drops them both. On that one. New Orleans in the lead. Here's Graham. <laughs> what a big finish out on the backcourt. That might be exactly what they needed at this point of the game. Defense has got to be better. Flat out effort was not there. Williams passes to Tatum. And he banks in the layup. <laughs> I didn't mean to pass that, but I... <laughs> Graham's got nine points now in the second half. Time and time again, they're creating good looks from close range. Here's Williams. And it's in there. Fuck out of here. You can tell his Come on now. inspires the entire squad. He really gets everyone so amped up. Outside Graham. Pass to Williamson. The kick out to Graham. Oh! 
brought to life. Oh, he nice thing. Let's the three fly. Doesn't go for him. Austin Trailer. Oh. Williams passes to Brown. Back to Williams. And the call will be against Brandon Ingram. That's foul number two for him. Or first, he's checked in for Cannonball. Second team ball. Final quarter here, and we're just over a minute and a half through it. Graham against Williams. Over Graham. Two looks. And Josh Richardson gets oh the whistle. Oh my goodness. Foul of the game. First team foul. Norris has gone 0 for 2 from outside here in the fourth quarter. Graham with it. Now Horford defending. Horford with the net. Well, a level of engagement that Horford brings on the defensive end every night is impressive. Terrific block there. To take the lead and reject it. Oh, what the? To the paint. Here's Williamson. Denied. Good block. Good block. Good block. Pass it down. Damn. Against Graham. Tatum with a screen. Williams into the lane. Oh, man. Let's go. Why? What the hell? Struggle for him tonight. Oh my goodness. They can make this lead hold up. He can just chalk this up as one of those nights. Back to Ingram. And a slam dunk by Ingram. Okay, okay. He's just so long, able to get to that rim pretty quick. Steps back. Fader on the way. Come on. Pelicans cleared away. No. Hart's got six rebounds here tonight. The three. And it's nope. Ingram with the basket. On the assist from Hart. Hart. <laughs> Two. Come on, man. And now a four-point New Orleans <sighs> lead. Now the D has done a very poor job at contesting him from outside, guys. He's tearing into them right now. And they cannot stop him. And it's Williams off the drop. It's deflected. Oh, oh good, good block, good block, good block. Alexander Walker's checked in. Alexander Walker. Clock at six. Shoots from the right block. And it's Williams. Too little. Bucket inside. Too little. Williams has got eight here in this quarter. Yeah, he recognized the size mismatch. No reason to pass out of that. Just rise up and knock it down. And stolen by Let's go. Williams. To the middle. Tatum passes to Williams. Williams Tatum. the board. Oh. Williamson's got 12 rebounds here tonight. Big time effort. Graham goes in from the paint. Come on. Good D by Richardson. He's as surprised as we are. Most nights that bucket is automatic. Here's Williams with the drive. Connect. And it goes out of bounds. Oh. Last touch by Williams. One of their four threes Down to go two. here in the fourth quarter. Graham, the pass to Hayes. And here's Ingram. Hayes with a screen on Brown. Back to Hayes. And oh my gosh. Oh, oh, right oh, partner, oh, Ingram oh, creating oh, the oh, offense oh, in the pick and roll. And that's a nice read. It's Williams. High post. It's blocked. No. And they get it back. <laughs> Right. Can't hit. I mean, he's trying to shoot his way out of what's becoming a prolonged cold streak. Yeah, he's got to move on, forget about this sequence here, and, and try to find a way to get on the board. With the fadeaway. Williamson misses. The Celtics shooting at 31% here in this fourth quarter. Williams up top. Graham covering. Looking to get back on track. And Williams punches it home. Get up there, young fella. Sometimes as a point guard, you gotta take it yourself. 
Well, it's okay to be selfish when you can flush it like that. Well, if he's Whoa. calling his own number, there's a yeah, reason for it. There you respect the decision making from him out there. Outside, Williams. Tatum, a screen on Graham. Pass to Tatum. And Why do you not A's. cut in? Here's Alexander uh, Walker. Like what? Now Graham. And here's Williamson. Oh. Warford covering. Outside for Ingram. Oh. And the Pelicans get it back. Thank Hard you. work on the glass gives them back. Pass it down. And they get to milk a little clock here. Here's Warford. And Horford powers it home. Pretty strong and physical that time from Al Horford on the inside. Williamson with a screen on Williams. Here's Graham. Horford pulls it in. Let's go. A lot of defenders choose to just right. back up off the He's in that tight, Move. try to avoid the in one, and this time they're not backing off. Williams passes to Tatum. Let's go. Tatum it home. Give Tatum tight game. Credit. Getting ideal positioning in. Now here's Ingram. Williamson with a screen. Yeah, he's back in two, but and Josh Richardson oh, gets the whistle that time. Oh, no, be a second no, no, no. Two and ten. Shouldn't be this close. Real. Out to the right wing. Oh. Hayes with a screen on Williams. Graham. When a big guy like Horford Bro. comes into your peripheral just as you're releasing the shot, it can definitely alter it. Here's Williams. And no. misses. That would have put him up. No. Oh, no. Crashing the board. No. Fighting hard for a miss. Up. Ram for three. No. He can't get that one to fall. And Boston going the other way now. Williams in the post. Graham covering. Back to Williams. Screen by Horford. And it's Williams off the drive. Rebounded by New Orleans. Can I get Pow! No. Here's Alexander Walker. Up and over Richardson. No way. High quality look as he sinks it. And the Pelicans lead by Boston. Celtics shooting around 33%, not the best offensive efficiency. Here's Williams. And they pick up two. Go. Williams has got 14 yes. points now in the second half. The defense kind of opened up for him, and he took full advantage. Turn it up. Here's Ingram, and he'll take no. a two. Oh, on. What? What is it about? Dude. Each and every year, and so he drops them both, it. and it's a two-point ball game. You might want to think twice before sending him to the line again. He gets locked in when the game gets close. Some Come solid on. defense from Ingram. New Orleans oh, has got just one of six threes to oh, go in the fourth. Oh. Williamson passes to Ingram over Horford. Hits wide right, hits off the rim. And for the Celtics, they're shooting right around 40%. Oh, Would you say testing the limits of his range there? Well, I thought they played smart. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Made up that. That's unfortunate. That's bad. Ingram against Brown. The shot by Let's go. Boston has gone 0 for 2 from outside here in the fourth quarter. Tatum a screen on Graham. Horford left side. <laughs> 59 seconds left to play in the fourth quarter. Wow. Come on, man. That takes steady nerve right there. <laughs> Not backing down from this moment here. When the game is close, he kicks it up enough. New Orleans calls timeout. I too. Let's go. <laughs> Thank you, Ali. Oh. 
still in it. I'll tell you, such an advantage having a playmaker who can get up to the rim and finish. Now that is what every team wants. I'd like to see that oh, my. especially from the guy who's going to orchestrate your offense. Back to Ingram. Fires for three. It's good! Damn it. He's a guy that lives for a big moment like that. Great focus and courage in the clutch. Williams passes to Brown. Come on. Thank you. Thank you. Let's go. Tell him down. No foul. No nothing. Brown against Ingram. No. 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 Oh my gosh. No. 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 Tatum from long range. Can't knock in the three. Oh, so he gets them both. And it's a five point game. Put a bow on this one. His composure at the line. So good. It's all because of Tatum. No, it's all because of that damn screen, man. Damn screen, fuck me. I like comments, really.